Hey, Anna, what is your favorite word? My favorite word? Ooh. Um, I kind of like shady. Okay, what's your least favorite word? Juicy. Mm. What turns you on? Um, I don't know. Probably the typical college jock. And what turns you off? Oh, uh, using correct grammar and punctuation. Mm. What sound or noise do you love? I don't know. I love the sound of a of a um, like a convertible or a Mustang that stick shift and then the engine revs. The big throaty. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what sound or noise do you hate? Oh, my alarm clock. <laughs> What's your favorite curse word? Oh, oh gosh, I use them all. Um, I'd have to say fuck, probably. It's It goes around. That's yeah, pretty good. Oh, what profession, other than the one that you are currently attempting, would you like to attempt? Um, I would love to have gone into law. Like full-on lawyer, like, or like yes. courtroom, or like litigation? No, for, uh, just a full lawyer. What profession would you never like to attempt? Interior design. Mm. If heaven exists, what would you like to hear God say when you get there? Oh, God, if heaven existed and then I'm having to rewatch my life, I'd like him to say, hold on, now here comes the good part. <laughs> Um, now, you've got a big DVD release today. Tell us a little bit about the um, the setting and the plot for this one. Um, if you are a fan of horror movies, the um, series Scream um, that starred uh, Nave Campbell was um, sort of our inspiration for this. It's more of a horror movie style fraternity house. Um, it's called Frat House Cream. Uh, it's shot with Naked Sword, who is an amazing company. And basically the storyline, you're going to follow Kev as he has been left alone at the fraternity house, waiting for his stepbrother to show up. His, all, all his friends go out. Power goes out. Some things happen. It's, it's shot really well, and it's not anything that looks like just a low-class porno. So um, I think everybody's really going to be pleased with it. It was amazing to work with the people I did, and it was amazing to just set the premise up and watch it come to life. Was it the first scripted property that you'd worked with? Yes. I, uh, like three or four days before I flew out, I got this 11-page script in the email. I was like, oh, I'd never had to do this before. So, you know, not only are you trying to make sure your acting doesn't come across as, you know, shoddy, but you're also having to try and be intimate at the same time. It was a very uh, difficult challenge to, to try and learn everything that had to do with the script and everything that had to do with the scene. Now, is it something that you'd be interested in doing again, though? Yes. It, uh, I, I still say to this day that all the companies I've worked with have been great, but Naked Sword is my absolute favorite, only because there is so much scripting, and, and it's not just, you know, walk in, you know, spend a few hours, do your 30-minute scene, then leave. You um, were the side of a bus, apparently, uh, today. How does it feel to be a uh, bus-side celebrity? <laughs> I remember seeing that, and I was the whole time I was thinking, is this real? And I was just thinking, how, now, how many people are actually going to go online and search this and not really understand what exactly it is? I, <laughs> I don't know how I feel about it, honestly. It was... Uh, amazing, even if it was just Photoshop, it was just amazing flattery to see that. Well, we very much look forward to seeing some more of your work. Uh, Frat House Cream is a Naked Sword production, and that comes out today. So go ahead and check that out. Uh, Hunter, just give everyone uh, a little heads up about uh, any other things that are coming up for you right now. Um, <clears throat> for me right now, I'm uh, starting to change up, change the look. My fans been talking to a few of the fans and everything, and kind of getting tired of, of you know, the, the same ordinary uh, that we're all used to. So I'm probably taking about a two to three month hiatus, and I'm going to 
I do a lot of working out, do a lot of working on myself, getting my future prepared for college in the uh, spring. And, and I think that there, there's some amazing companies that I've been talking to and some amazing uh, actors that I've been willing to work with. And I think there's a lot coming up within the next couple of months that just it's something to look forward to. Well, we'll keep our eyes peeled on your Twitter account. Go ahead and uh, give us all the other, other places we should be looking at for your social media. Uh, I, you can follow me on Instagram, Hunter Page XXX, or you can find me besides on Twitter. I'm working on a Tumblr, same uh, username as Instagram, but see how this goes. You can also find me on Vine, Hunter Page XXX. I'm just same thing for everything. Very consistent. We like that. Thank you very much for joining us today, and look forward to a little bit later on today when we talk to Go Go Harder. And then, of course, tonight at 9 p.m. Eastern, we're going to do GSC Friday live uh, with Twitter questions, and we'll be on air. So make sure you check back for that as well. For now, thanks everybody, and good night.